All right. So um, I'm going to describe the Dandy Dash. If all of the ladies who signed up for the Dandy Dash could please come onto the stage right now, all of the women. Or not the stage, sorry, ladies. When I say stage, I obviously mean the dance floor. <laughs> um, so this is going to be two different heats. First, we'll have the ladies. Then we will have the gentlemen. First, the contestants will find the missing half of a ticket. So they're going to be given one half of the ticket. And then they need to find the ticket that matches the serial number that is on the ticket that they have. They will then get a teacup, fill that teacup with what we're calling water, but who knows, it might be giggle juice. That's what we called liquor back in the 1920s. Um, so they're gonna fill a teacup, they're gonna run down the hill with the teacup. They need to still have some liquid in their teacup when they get down to the bottom of the hill. If they don't, they're disqualified. So ladies, watch those teacups, keep some water in them. Third, they're going to be given a cane or a stick, you know, whatever. And they're gonna put a hat on the end of that stick and they're gonna race back up. They have to keep the hat on the end of the stick or they will be disqualified. Once they get back to the dance floor, they're going to have a spoon. They're gonna dip the spoon in a bucket of feathers and then they're going to have to deposit those feathers that are on the spoon into their upturned hat that is further on the dance floor. It's gonna be wild. One, two, Standing in the way, you are going to get mowed over by crazy guys and racing down this hill. So please, try to keep the alleyway clear for just like four minutes. Thank you. All right, gentlemen. One, two, three, go take it.
cheaters, which is what we call glasses, who cheated. This will be low prize. Come on over, Edgar. The gentleman who cheated, who bears the cheaters. But that wasn't fair. Thank you. 